What exactly is an inverted yield curve and why is there so much negative attention on it? Yield curve inversions occur when longer term yields, generally defined by 10 year treasury yields, fall below shorter term yields, generally defined by two year treasury yields. Traditionally, this phenomenon has been considered a harbinger for economic contractions as the vast majority of U.S. recessions have been preceded by an inverted yield curve. This is a main reason the persistent flattening of the yield curve has been receiving so much attention lately. As such, investors are feeding on this negativity and ignoring other important facts. Here are three realities investors should focus on in our view. Number one, signs of a U.S. recession are not prevalent. Housing, employment, the consumer, and credit all remain very healthy. Number two, the BMO economics team has actually increased their GDP assumptions for both 2018 and 2019 as the year has unfolded. And number three, from an investment strategy perspective, U.S. earnings growth is robust and stable while valuations have actually contracted in 2018, setting the stage for longer term U.S. outperformance in our view. What's the bottom line? While an inverted yield curve may indeed occur at some point this year, the facts and analysis do not suggest any impending economic damage. As such, investors should avoid the negative rhetoric and focus on the analysis.